Oh, hi. Uh, hello, everyone. And um, recently, I get a customer phone call, and uh, they have uh, some uh, some uh, connection issue with uh, with their device and the CMW five hundred. And uh, firstly, okay, firstly, um, you know, I want to thank for Roger Schwartz and uh, bring this uh, beautiful piece, and uh, it's uh, it's easy to use and. Uh, a lot of functions, uh, but uh, you know, uh, but you need sometimes you need to figure out uh, some a uh, little bit detail for the for the setup over here. So uh, I'm gonna show you how to connect to the to the to the you know to the device uh, on the single uh, signal mode. So uh, firstly, once you get uh, this instrument, uh, you don't know. You know somebody has used it before so we just go uh, reset and uh, okay uh, and then go preset uh, uh, preset all global applications so now is everything restored to the uh, factory size so we gonna go oh okay we turn on the signaling mode and over here and uh, signaling one okay Okay, and then we go some detail setup over here. Click a configure con configuration. So firstly, okay, set up uh, your RF port over here. It's a, I'm using RF one, so you can see the, uh, you can see the mark uh, on your, uh, you know, front end. There is RF one over there. Okay. And the, and then you go the RF sighting. Uh, you need to make some uh, compensation for your for your you know pass loss. So uh, I I like to use the thirty. Uh, it's a little bit high, but I want to make sure uh, the de device can connect to the uh, you know uh, over uh, can connect to the instrument. Um, you know. Um, it's all air. I mean, use an antenna over there. So sometimes you use a RF cable. It's probably just one or two, or even the zero two. So uh, I can show you how to measurement the measurement the cable, the cable loss by using CMW five to make sure it's working perfectly. And uh, probably another video. Okay, uh, here uh, once this done, and you go to the okay here network. Uh, there are a couple of things over here. First is the uh, security setting, and uh, this uh, that's uh, a secret key over here. Um, for for the default sighting, it's fine for this uh, for the same car uh, my customer is using, uh, and uh, the other thing. Uh, oh yeah, if you use a key side or a visual, yeah, uh, like a you know, eighty uh, twenty or eighty twenty one is a different uh, secret 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 key. And uh, okay, here is a is a UE. Uh, it's a user and identity. So uh, this is uh, you can find on your SIM card. For this uh, card, it's a zero zero one zero one two three four five six seven eight nine zero one. Enter. So okay, and uh, pretty much is is done and uh, big. Uh, Thanks to Roda Schwarz and make it, um, you know, it's uh, really easy. So I turn on the mode. Uh, okay. Uh, okay, it's a uh, quick connected. It's already connected. Uh, okay, my customer want to connect to band two. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, my phone is unlocked. The phone, so that's why it's uh, has all has all 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 kind of bands. So. I just connect to band two, and if you have AT and T, you probably connect to AT and T band. So that's a quick video uh, I show you. And uh, my name is Eric Gao with AIV System. And if you have any CMW five hundred questions, or we can discuss, uh, email me or call me. And uh, thanks for watching the video. Thank you very much. Bye.